Now that you've created your Equit account, I'd like to give you a quick overview of some key features and show you how you can create an online store and add products so you can get started selling. First, the main navigation on the left side of your screen is set up so that the pages you'll use most often are located at the top, such as managing your sales in the My Sales page and managing your products in the catalog section. At the bottom of the navigation are items you'll access less frequently and usually only during the initial store setup. These are the set it and forget it type things like store name and address, as well as shipping and payment options. The fastest way to get started setting up your store is following the setup wizard. I'll give you a quick demonstration of how it works. Since you've already created your account, let's start with the second step, create your online store. When you click into this step, you'll be asked if you have a website. If you click yes, you'll be given options for adding your Equid store to your website. Just pick the platform and follow the instructions. If you're a WordPress user, You'll be happy to know we have a great WordPress plugin for connecting and managing your store within WordPress. Now, if you don't have a website, no problem. Let's go back to the previous screen and select, no, I don't have a website. Equid comes with a very powerful and beautifully designed free online store. And by default, the web address for that store is the store ID assigned to you by Equid. But you can change it to something more user-friendly here. I'll change mine to running gear. Now by clicking save, my new website and store have been created. Here's the web address for my new website, and by clicking on it, I'll see my new store. You can scroll down, and you can see that we've pre-populated it with some demo products to see how they look. But let's go back to the dashboard and add some products of our own. Let's hit proceed to next step to get back to the setup wizard. And now let's click on the third step, add products. To add a product, simply give it a name, a price, and upload an image. For example, I'll add a men's running shirt priced at $45. And hit save. That product has now been added to my store. Now, if I go back to my store and hit refresh, when I scroll down, you'll see that the running shirt now appears. Most likely when you add products to your store, you'll want to include more than just the product name, price, and image. So let's go back to the Equid control panel and see what else we can do. There are three options for adding products. The first and easiest way is by using the setup wizard as I just demonstrated. The second is by navigating to the products section under catalog. This option for adding products provides more advanced features such as adding product descriptions, additional images, the ability to add product options like size and color, manage inventory, and much more. This will probably be your preferred method for managing products as you build out your store and become more familiar with Equid. The third and final option for adding products is the import wizard. This is especially useful if you have a lot of products or if you're migrating from another e-commerce platform. For now, let's go back to the dashboard and continue with the setup wizard. Click on step four, verify geo settings. Here, you just need to confirm your country, currency, and weight settings. This will ensure that things like price and weight appear correctly in your store. Hit edit to make any changes. Otherwise, click proceed to next step. Now you need to provide some basic information about your company. This will be used for things like invoices and calculating shipping rates. Fill in the appropriate information and click Save. Step 5 defines a shipping method for your products. If you sell services or digital goods that do not need to be shipped, just select Disable Shipping for Products. However, if you plan to ship physical goods, then click Set Up Shipping. Depending on your region, you'll see different options available to you. Just select the options that you want to enable for your customers. You can also add additional shipping options and access advanced features by selecting the Shipping and Pickup option from the main navigation bar. Returning to our setup wizard, 
you can see that we only have one step left, get paid. Here's where you'll define which payment options you want to make available to your customers. These options will vary depending on your region. The setup process is slightly different depending on the payment options you select. Just choose one and follow the setup instructions. That's it. You've now completed the setup wizard and can start selling online. But there are a lot more features still available. So before I go, there are two other important things I'd like to highlight. First, you can control the appearance of your store within the design section. For example, you can control the size and shape of the product images, product alignment, and even which attributes to display, such as product name and price. The interactive designer allows you to preview the changes without leaving the page. There are lots of options here, so I encourage you to explore and experiment on your own. The second feature I want to show you is under the Reports section. The first option is a reporting app that will show you real-time traffic and trends for your store. This will give you insights on what your customers are doing when they visit your store. Use this information to understand your store visitors and sell more effectively. Because it's an app, it's something you'll need to install. It's free, so just click Install Now and follow the instructions. For additional resources, please visit support.equid.com.